Hello artists, today we're going to continue working on your shields. So we need to go in with scissors and we're going to cut where the line was. Now your shield's going to get a little more personality to it. So we're going to clean up anything that was slightly messy. I'm going to add a nice little divider in the center. And if you're using one of the flat brushes, remember we're only painting with them one way. Whenever you're ready to change colors, scrub a dub dub on the bottom of the tub. Dry on SpongeBob. No bang bang. Unnecessary. If you have accidental splatters, we're not worrying about it. We can turn it into something else. Once you've added your extra details to the background, then it's time to think about something called heraldry or your coat of arms. So I have a handout that can give you a lot of ideas or you could come up with your own. And this is gonna be the symbol that represents your family. And there's some that are easier, some that are harder. And you could have more than one if you wanted. You could paint something just in the center or mine's broken into four sections so I can have four different symbols. And once this is dry, I will add a handle to the back of your shield and it will be fully functional.